Taylor here with AgriSpray Drones. We get a lot of questions about how the T40 handles terrain because a lot of the demos that we do and a lot of the demos that we show, we are on a pretty flat field or a field with a very gentle slope. So here we are actually at a field that's got a lot of terraces, a lot of fairly steep terraces, uh, a pretty typical field right around here in Boonville, uh, Missouri. Um, so this is kind of the situation a lot of guys find themselves in that you know the the planes have a hard time really following the contour of these fields especially when you have trees surrounding them so how would a drone react to the same situation holding that height as it goes up and down the hill so that's what we're going to be showing today so first thing we've done is we put a map out here uh, to show it going up and down the hill and then the second thing we've done is we've set our uh, our radar terrain height or our, our task terrain, they actually call it, to what they call mountain mode. Um, and obviously, it's not a mountain, but what that does, it is allows the radar to react uh, much more quickly to terrain changes. All right, so all we have to do is hit start, take off, and start flying. So we're going to take off autonomously. Just like always, fly out to the start point. I should, I should also note that um, we talk about using RTK uh, for you know, following terrain, if you have steep terrain. Uh, we are not on RTK right now. This is just using the radar height. Um, so we talk about using RTA, RTK, that's really in reference to being able to um, you know, pre-map the field um, and do a, a terrain map prior to actually coming to the field. So there you go. You see the T-40 is actually following that slope as it goes up the hill. Jumping right over those terraces where our operating height right now is 10 feet. We're flying at about 23 feet per second uh, or about 15 miles an hour up and down this hill. And it's having no problems right now. There's at the top. It's going to turn around and fly back down the hill. And while it does that, I'm going to go ahead and reduce our height. Let's just make this seven feet. Or eight feet right there. Eight feet is as low as you can go in mountain mode. There you see the drone is actually lowering down to that eight feet. It saw a terrace. Now it's going back down. Up and over those terraces. See it kind of bunny hopping over those terraces actually. So then in mountain mode, the T-40 reacts to terrain changes pretty quickly. There it goes up and over that terrace, and then down in the valley. So this is, we don't have to do any pre-mapping. All we had to do is show up right here. We put in the coordinates of the field, we put in the boundary, set it to mountain mode, and let it go. So the T-40 does terrain following quite a bit differently than a lot of other spray drones. Instead of using only a radar, it actually uses two cameras on the front of the drone, uh, what's called its, um, its binocular vision system. So it's actually building out that terrain map uh, as it flies, trying to get a very, very detailed uh, map of the terrain, figuring out, okay, what's part of the terrain and what is an obstacle essentially allowing the drone to operate on fairly steep terrain up to about 30 degree slopes. If you have higher than 30 degree slope on your field, then you'll have to actually do a, a, pre, a 3D flight route map, which we'll show that in a whole different video. Um, but if you don't have uh, you know, more than 30 degree slopes, or even if you do have 30 degree slopes, you can actually help the T-40 up a really, really steep hill by simply pushing up on the stick. So that's the great thing about the DJI system is it's, it's a hybrid manual and autonomous system. So if I just push up on this left stick right here, then the drone's actually going to fly higher. There you see it flying higher. It's still spraying, but it's flying higher. And there it's dropping back down and continuing the mission. So if you're going up the hill, which when it turns around, I'll show you that. If you're going up the hill and it's a really, really steep hill, then all you have to do is just kind of help the drone up that hill by pushing this left stick up. So there it's turning, I'm ready to fly back up the hill. And here we go, I'm just gonna push this left stick up. There we go, it, re it responds by flying a bit higher. There it goes, I'm just holding that left stick up, just kind of helping it a little bit. Now, now we're out of product. So 
So that's as simple as it gets when it comes to terrain following with the T40, using the radar, using the mountain mode setting. If you have really, really steep terrain, then watch out for our other video on 3D flat route mapping. Thanks.